they can't hear in public say, I condemn Israel. They can't do that. But in a private conversation, they will. But can they do that in public, that she condemns Israeli aggression and terrorism? Have you asked her that? Can we, can we do that, this one, one, this one, so that it goes in public? Do you condemn Israeli aggression? I condemn all of them. No, do you condemn Israeli aggression by specific... Israeli aggression, one of them. No, specifically, just I want... She says... Brother, it's important. I want to hear specifically, just say, I condemn Israeli terror and aggression. We are not in accord, we are not in accord to just condemn... No, 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 no. We are not in accord to condemn or... No, 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 I just want to, I want to hear, I want to hear. So resistance is raping. They're taking... Just bring me one evidence. Maybe you should look on Telegram, Hamas itself. Maybe you should look on Telegram. Sorry? Actually, like even him, he's saying that... Come on, seriously. Let's come on. Even him what? You said that you had the rape and the killing. He never said that. Do you have evidence for the 40 babies no, 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 being beheaded? I, I didn't say 40 Wherever babies. Up, That's what they claim, right? I, I don't claim anything. Didn't anything. I didn't was, say claiming about anything. Isn't that what they I'm claim? Saying, I'm saying women have been raped. No, no. I'm saying women have but been raped. But that's not what we're discussing. We are discussing Enough with the Israeli claims, like, like, 40 babies were beheaded. <laughs> Why is my world done? <laughs> You are saying something that I didn't say. I said I'm here to play both games. I know, that's not very good. Your role is done now. Don't play this part. No, no, but 100%, 100%, 100% women were raped. 100%. And babies were taken out of their womb. Who says that? Okay, okay, let's say, let's say, let's say, let's say, let's say that was right. Then let's say that happened. How do you compare it to killing 50,000 civilians in the worst possible way? Okay, so let me ask you a question. Let's understand. You so cannot even compare so it. Even no, if it's I'm not saying I'm comparing anything. anything. I'm saying killing on both sides is bad. I said that over there. I said over there. Yeah, but that doesn't justify what's happening on the ground. I agree. I agree. So do you do you do you think? I'm in the middle of position. I agree. It doesn't justify to kill babies over there in in uh, Gaza. Do you think it's it doesn't a gone bit over the proportion? Yes. Right. Yes. So so what should what 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 should Israel do? Stop. I, I, I don't know. I'm not a politician. I don't know. I don't live there. Of they course you know. Of the they need, they, but I they don't need know. to stop. I'm, I can't make um, that decision. Uh, my friend, they I need to stop. Of same. course you know. They need to stop killing. And, and, okay, and do what? Let's let's let's. I'm, I'm, no, I'm going with your. I'm going with your thought. And Why is it not your thought? No, no, I'm going, first of all, because I don't know what to do. I, 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 I don't If I tell you, people are when killing... I don't know what to do, I'm, I don't know I'm, what to do. I want to I wanna see your thinking. Okay. There are Israelis killing by hundreds and thousands, right? Killing innocent people is wrong, right? Agreed. Good. So what needs to be done first is to stop killing or let them carry on killing? Stop killing who? Stop killing the innocent people. Agreed. I so, agree. so why do you say that I didn't know? You do know. No, no, so hold on. So the let me first ask thing is, can I ask a question? I'm asking what they should do after. No, but let me ask you a question. No, no. After, ask, after, yeah, after, after, question. after comes after. No, no, after comes now because after came October first, 7. Wait, wait, wait. So let me ask you the question. October 6. Let's not talk about 6. No, hold on a second. October 6. October 5th. I know it's 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 the it's the game. It's not a game. No, I, listen, listen. It's not here, a game. Here. It's the reality on the ground. Okay, reality on the ground. So okay, the fine. moment somebody brings October six and seven, I will. But what I'm saying is, okay. the moment you bring or oh, start on October seventh, okay. that's a smoke screen. I agree. Good. So forget October seventh. No, what we're saying is now. God, I can't forget October seventh. One moment. One moment. One moment. One moment. Brother, one moment. I want to ask you a question. Not letting when you. there are, I am. I'm, I'm going to allow you. But let's 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 let me set the scene. Now they're killing innocent people and children. So what is the first thing that we demand, we expect from them? To stop. stop. Exactly. So this is what you should be telling people, whole world. Let them stop. No, but I'm telling you that. I told you that. You said, well, I don't know what to do, no, I what to say. say. I, I it's say on that. camera, my friend. But, but, That's what you said. I don't listen, know. Listen, Did you I not say that? Am I making this up? Oh my God. Not like one question. Can I ask you one question? Yes, go ahead. Okay. What the day after? Okay. The day after they stop? Yeah. Let's say, let's say Israel stops now, right now, not tomorrow. Now, right now. What will happen? Yeah. People will go, let, let them, mm -hmm. they need to let the aid go in. They need to let the money go in so we can build our cities again. Do you agree? So we can build Gaza yes. again. 
to rebuild. Yes, I agree. So I agree. people can go I back agree. to their I agree. Now they're stopping. Right. Agree. They're stopping. Okay, and let's do that. And then the next day you can talk about it. Start with this, and then we talk about next. But you don't live. But you don't live there. You don't. Then you can tell you. Can I, can I finish the line? Yeah. Can I finish? But you don't live on the other side where women are raped. Come on. The example, okay. The example. How many, how many women raped here in UK? You don't, don't live, you don't start know. killing people because someone will rape you from Gaza, so I have to push them. No, no, but this is what but, you want to do. No, 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 but hold on a second. Woman, I'm okay. no, okay. I, We need I to stop rape happening. Listen, I said, I said, what did I say to you two seconds ago? Hmm? What did I say two seconds ceasefire. ago? Two seconds ago. Ceasefire, stop. Hold on. Yeah. Stop and yeah. come out. I said that okay. not tomorrow let, today. Let me, let, let, me, let, me, let, me, let me see what you've said so far. Stop, stop killing. He's not listening. I am listening. Stop I'm killing. Listening. I said, Let the humanitarian I aid come in. I agree everything. And and so and far, then and so far, we should stop people committing rape and killing. Agree? agree. That's agree. the next step. That's it. Right. Agree. Right. I so agree. You, but that's so, the problem. So, so the problem is, yeah. it's not happening. I know, but do I make the rules? It will never happen. You have a voice. But I'm making my voice now. Good. How do you know? That's what we are asking for. Do I make for. the rules? No, no. That's what we are asking. Do I we make want. The rules? We want. But people. you asked me what would you possible, do. Possible. I can't do okay. anything, and I said that. Are you a Palestinian? No. No. Are you a Muslim? No. Right. Do you know much about Islam? No. Sure. Yeah. yeah. What you know? Yeah. I have. I have. Listen. Yeah, yeah. Uh, right. Hey, hey. The principle that we talked about. Wait, hold on. Killing a hey, innocent the people. The question. Hmm? Can you wait a second? You ask me questions. Let me answer. Good, good. Uh, you have to read it. Right. I just got it. Yeah. 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 I can't read it in three minutes, you know? You're showing us yeah. this? So, so, from here, from here, <laughs> so from here, yeah, yeah. The what's the next step? Do you read books? Yeah, yeah. It's got the Quran. You have to read. Do you know what's I the next step? An hour, no problem. No, I just got an hour. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's got one. Do <laughs> you know what's the next step? What's the next step? Once you examine and assess this book, the next step would be submitting and surrendering. I don't know. Like you just, agree? I don't know. The next step. Know. I'm just giving you the next step. Next step. Once you realize the truth yeah, in I Islam, don't know, but I don't know until okay. I read it. Okay. You don't know what you don't know okay. until you don't fine, know. Fine, fine, right? fine. So, do you know that there is a God of this universe yes. created? Yes. Can there be more than one of such a being? No. Right. So you believe that there has to be we one God? That already. Two hours no, no. ago. Fine. <laughs> so I, I'm telling you what you know about Islam already. So you know. That we believe in one absolute God, one okay. absolute creator. So do I. That's what I'm saying. Okay. So you know already what Islam teaches. There so is why one. Do I to read the book then? To understand the other perspective. Yeah. 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 That's a good answer. Okay. To understand what we are like. To understand how do you we are. also we accept? To understand who you are. We're willing to understand who you are. Yeah. 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 To expect each other. Listen, when, I, when I see a good answer and I hear a good answer, I tell you. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Do you accept that God sends guidance? No. <laughs> I don't want to go home. My wife and kids are home. Do you do you accept God sends guidance? Don't, don't put that on video. My wife and kids are home. <laughs> do you accept God sends guidance? Do I accept? Sorry, what? God sends guidance through prophets and messengers. That I don't know. Okay. How does God communicate with us, telling us why He created us? How, how does He do that? I don't know. Okay. I'm not, I'm not, I don't think I'm the right person to ask. Okay, so God tells us he does not. I'm not understanding okay. God enough, maybe. I don't know. Okay, so God, our Creator, God tells us He communicates us. One of the ways He does that by sending prophets and messengers. And when we examine their life, their teaching. Yeah, but that's what you believe. I'm telling you the that's ways you God communicates. Now, do that's you have a problem believe. accepting that? Yes, because I don't know that. Okay. How would you know that this is not the communication method? I don't. It right. might be. How would you know? I wouldn't know. Okay. How would you be convinced yeah. that God How would I be convinced? Yeah, that if God can communicate. Yeah. If someone actually communicated that with me. Yeah. If God so communicated. So you're I'm saying not, I don't think I'm close enough for... Do you expect event. personal revelation to you from God? No, why not? It would be nice. No, no, no. And if it, <laughs> you know. I mean, why do you think you are more worthy of I'm receiving... Not. That's why I said I'm not. Right. So why are you expecting it then? I'm not expecting it. No problem. Since you're not expecting it, 
but it would be nice you say so. But what we're saying is, even if you felt, somebody says, look, here is the problem with this kind of approach. This gentleman comes along and says, God has communicated with me and told me about this, and this is what you have to believe, and this is what we have to believe. It would be difficult for you to accept that claim. I don't think I would accept it. Yeah, it would be difficult for you to accept. Yeah. Unless that individual provides evidence for such a claim. Right? Oh, well, well, real evidence. You, real evidence, real exactly. Evidence. So this is what we're saying. Prophet Muhammad وسلم, he claimed that he received revelation from God. And the revelation he received is what this Quran is, oh, no, what is presented. And this is his evidence for his claim. He says this is a book. The book itself says that no one can produce a surah like it. No one can produce a surah like it. So I can't, I can't argue with you. I don't know. <laughs> no, no, I don't know. No, what I'm saying is... I know he's explaining to me. So he's saying, if you really think, if you really are doubtful that this is really communication from God, then this is a falsification test that you can carry out to falsify it. You can produce a whole book like it, 10, ten surahs like it, Surah is like a chapter, 10 surahs like it, or a single surah like the Quran. If you can't do it, then of course... I still don't have to believe it. No, no, we're saying, look... Until I read it and maybe... Yeah, yeah. You need to I mean, assess, verify and accept. By myself. Yes. yes. But what we, are saying is, what we are saying is, you need to see the evidence for this book that is from God. So when you look at the book itself gives us falsification test as a way of an evidence, then you feel that, yes, now I can see that there is substantial evidence for it to claim it's making. The Quran says, I'll, I'll if this you, book I'll wasn't from in, God... I'll see you in two weeks after I read it. Excellent. And we'll talk about Excellent. Oh, two, three weeks. Yeah, two weeks. Yeah, yeah. Read it, read it and then, then we can talk about it. I'm not a big reader, but it's not that long. Yeah, yeah, read, read. Please ask questions. Yeah, I can read it. And for you, just an advice. If you have any issue in life, just start fighting. Look at the digital, for the digital version of this. I don't like digital. Book is just fine. Just once, read it, read it. I'm old school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> read it. I find it difficult to read from digital books as well. Look, read this. Physical paper is very good. Just, just, just Google it. Not the Google. Chat GPT. No, no, no. Hmm? Chat GPT. Search for Chat GPT. <laughs> Do you know what Chat GPT thinks about this book? I don't. I've made a video about it. And it says it's not possible for even Chat GPT to produce something like it. I'm sure it's not. You can look at the video and how I. Yeah, yeah. Because I went through Chat GPT to give him all the probes to see, okay, fine. Can you, as a linguistic model, produce some. Because it's a text, right? It's a literature. Um, can you make it something like it with all the conditions and criteria associated with it? It came up with the conclusion that it can't. Too many cameras. Oh. Yeah, unfortunately, that's the reality of speaking school. Yeah, I so, get it. Yeah, I get it now. Yeah, yeah. So this is what we're saying. Where's, the the where's it all gone? Hmm? Where's it all gone? Like, where's all this material gone? Uh, different YouTube channels. Oh, I okay. See. They, they will be uploaded even today, some of them, and others will be later. So I, if, if you look at this logo, so I, I have a channel called Dawa Wise. Uh, in that channel, you find a lot of our discussions there, and your discussion will most likely be on Dawa Wise, as well as some other YouTube channels. I'm not, I don't okay. think I'm not interesting. So <laughs> no, no, no. What it is? There are lots of videos. Any discussions that we are having, if people can learn from it then some, some contribution that we have made. Okay? I if I learn something from you, and you learn something from me, learned, and people... Me, 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 me I, learned, I learned that there's still hope. There's hope. That, of course there's hope. But I some, always believe in hope. I had a discussion earlier on. I believe I, in, I go, I believe in like, people are born good. You earlier know, on... And what they're taught is bad. You know, throughout life. I had, That's what I believe. I had a discussion earlier on. People watching that video will say, there's no hope. <laughs> Speaking to you, we have reignited this understanding. There is hope. Oh, I there is I'm hope, sure hope in truth and humanity. That humanity is such that we shouldn't discriminate people just because we think they're other. Because they may disagree with you in your understanding of things, but still the, the core values of what makes us human. And that's why I said, like, people yeah. are born initially good, yes. yeah. and then society, family, 
uh, school, friends, everything corrupts them, and that's how they grow up. Exactly. It's very, like, maybe half a percent are born genetically wrong. Yeah, yeah. You know, like serial killers. You have already agreed with Quran. Huh? You have already agreed with Quran. In, in, in um, the teaching of the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he says, I have been raised to perfect the nobility of character. So it assumes already people have the character, but he's come to a noble for to perfect it. So our already, already everyone is Muslim by birth. <laughs> people are born in this natural disposition to know the truth. Yeah, it's exactly as you said the environment, the family, the society, the conditioning that makes us to believe and, and accept something different. So, in, in your natural state of... So how do you change it? By coming back to the realization, coming back to the remembrance. So, reigniting what's already within us. Our reigniting the hope, you're saying. Reigniting the, the intuitive feeling that we have of virtues, okay, of truth, can, okay, so can, of love, know, of compassion, can, do that of justice. You can do that to intelligent people that yeah. listen, you can do that to intelligent people that can you know, talk, argue, yeah, really, and, argue reason. And, and reason. Sometimes reason, your reason is not my reason, or your reason is, every reason is different. Finding common but, grounds. Finding yeah, common, common grounds. grounds and exactly. build on this common ground. And see where our differences can be removed, but eliminated, or minimized. But then you get the younger generation, I'm not talking like this younger generation, I'm talking like 16, 17, 15, you can't talk to them somewhere. That's the generation that we need to work on. Work that's on that's with, that's, and that's the with, with with compassion and empathy. We need to understand them because if you don't understand but, but the you children, can, you can't work with them, and I can't work with them. No, no, we it's have to from, learn. It's come from family and friends, my friend, and from the older people. Do you have children? Yeah, yeah. We have to learn how to work with them. I know. Yep. We might think we are good parents already because we know it all. No. We really have to know how to engage with them because they are all this generation Z, millennium, TikTok generation and so on. How do they connect? They still value family. They still value or, on or the not love. Let them see all that. Yeah. Or not let but them see all that. What, like my kids are three. But what happens is they instead of instead of connecting with us, they connect with their peers, with their friends in social media and you know so you who drives You know who drives them away from family? Is certain corporations and big organizations yeah, which they have. Them away from yeah, them. you can say that exactly. Phones, phones exactly. And social media. Right? Yeah, yeah. That's that's why. Yeah, that's, that's why, why you gotta bring. I think my bring kids back. back to family. Exactly. Family cores and beliefs. Do you know how much importance Islam gives to family? <laughs> Amazing importance. Another thing is that God calls you. Call towards your eternal family. That's how you, when you connect to us, to connect to us, with the particles of the particles of the earth, they show up under the universal family. So that's how we call towards this family. How do you feel when you see people when we grow up and we become aged and elderly? The children, the same children that we so much took care of them. They send us to old people's home. What's your view on that? Listen, it depends on the situation of the old people. It depends. Mm -hmm. Sometimes the children themselves and the grandchildren cannot take care either physically themselves or financially in the home, or they have other kids that they have to take care of or other family members. But I would like my kids, you know, I got three kids, I would like my kids, you know, to take care of me in the home I grew up, you know, where they grew up. You know, but it depends, but if I'm completely like, and, and it takes a burden on their lives and their kids and their grandkids, then... But think about this though. Kick me burden, out. Burden, burden, yeah, but think about this burden on their life. If it wasn't for you and you are bringing them... I know, them, I know, but I made a commitment when I, when I brought them to the world and I took responsibility for my children. That's it. Yeah. So, on just like, have, just like no, you... I know, I get it. But just they, like they, you had responsibility and duty towards them. Right. Islam says they also likewise have a duty and responsibility towards us. I agree 100%. So they cannot they also have responsibility for their kids. No, of course. So, so they cannot they down. cannot simply yes, kick us out no, and put us in, into old people's home. Depends, that yeah. will be unjust. But that's generalized. Unmerciful. But that's no, I'm, I'm saying in principle. I know, but in principle yeah. is generalized. You, know, you can't I'm, say from one family to another situation. Exceptions different. in which look, what are the exceptions that they can put us into old people's home? What are those exceptions? 
again, their family situation at the time, my kids' family situation at the time. If they have a good time to look after us? No, if their health is bad. Maybe That's they, the physical inability? No, okay. physical inability for them. Maybe, yeah, yeah. God forbid, cancer. Yeah, yeah. Or something, or their kids have some physical inability. You know that they, I don't know, I don't want to know, you know? But, but other than that, they should take care of me and my wife, you know, at home. Yeah, so but this exception goes, but until, goes, when? But until, when? But this, but exception, until when? this exception is not only for children, this exception of inability to look after someone is regardless of who you are. If you have someone in a terminal cancer, you can't look after your father, your mother, your children, your neighbor, you can't look after anyone. Because if you're in a situation like that, terminally ill, that's an exception that it's not just specific to children or parents. Said, you said yeah, but I'm saying when it comes to duties and responsibilities of children and so on, yes. throwing your parents away to old people home, in principle, it's wrong. I agree. Yeah, so that's what Islam teaches. So you will find, my friend, what's your name? Rob. Rob. I'm Mansur. This is uh, Sarwab. You'll find a lot of the teaching of Islam that you will automatically agree on because that is something that is Islam has already put in in your natural disposition. Okay, these virtues that you know that okay, you know, committing injustice is wrong. No one has to teach you that. No one has to come and teach you that doing injustice is wrong. My parents taught me. I'm saying no one. Good, but they they have reminded you and consolidated you with already what in bill. Even if no one teaches you, give, let me give you an example. Your three-year-old, you've given them a gift, a toy that they like so much, okay? They're playing with it. I go and snatch it. What will be the reaction of your kid? Depends which one. I have twins. Okay. <laughs> Generally speaking, they won't like it. They won't like it. They will say, start crying. Oh, look what's happened. Someone's taken my dad. Help me out. Give me back. Because they feel and send something is I'm just happy. Unless, so, unless, again, there's unless exceptions. What? Unless? There's exceptions. Uh, unless, tell me. Unless, unless you explain to them the reason you're doing it. No, no, uh, without any reason. Snatching away. No, but, no, but you get snatching, but why snatch? You're not, taking you're not, away. Forcing, not, taking away. I know, but you're not a maniac. And saying it's mine. But you're not a maniac. No, no, if why I did that, that? No, no, if I did that, it's, it's, it's mine now. Who How would they feel? As a parent or as a stranger? No, no. Me, an individual. Come to my kids? Yeah. And take it away from you again? And your children, forcefully. how would they, yeah. Forcefully? And, forcefully and, and they think, and they would, how would they react? No, but I can't say it on camera. Okay, <laughs> okay, okay. Let's not take your kids. Someone else's kid, right? Yes, yes. How do we see in reality they react? They react with, no, you can't take it, it's mine. They sense this injustice. So I'm saying, these little children, they may not have been told what is just and what is unjust, but it's already there inherently in there. So what I'm saying is, I'm just trying to... Unless you explain to them, and there's a good reason for why you, why you did it, or why the stranger did without it. Teaching without, them, without teaching them what's just or not just, you can expect this reaction. So this is just demonstrating there are things inbuilt within us already. From God, yeah, whatever you want to say. From God, our Creator, so that at least you know, we can't make an excuse, I didn't know what justice was. Well, I didn't know who God was, what God was, our creator was. Even this belief in the existence of God is already inbuilt. But people try to cover it up. They try to cover it up, saying, no, 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 we didn't, we didn't have, have a creator, we don't have a creator, it's evolution, it's Richard Dawkins, it's this and that. There's always this covering up. Okay? So, I don't think you'll find a lot of disagreements when it comes to this, these existential questions, this reality about Islam. And when you go probe deep and deep, inshallah, you will see that the Quran brings to you this concept of justice as an essential and important aspect of, you know, human uh, belief and interactions. Justice. And that's why when we started talking about injustice is happening from any side in Gaza, whether the Muslims doing it or the non-Muslims doing it, injustice is injustice. We have to say wrong is a wrong. The moment you make a wrong right, that's when the problem starts. Yeah? yeah, I agree with and that. And the moment... So, uh, and an the, hour ago we agreed on yeah, that. Yeah, and the moment... And we're, the moment, we're agreeing to agree, we're not agreeing no, no, that's to disagree. What I'm, no, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> we are agreeing because agree. we have... We're agreeing to agree. We have, yes. We, we have built in morals. Yes, we have all these common grounds because this is where the truth lies. This is where the truth is. So how do you differentiate? How do you differentiate the... You know, like, 
you brought up Gaza again. You know, so I'm open, you open the door again, like a yes. lawyer. You know, you open the door. Yeah. You know, we talked about kids and everything, but how would you, you know, kind of like put everybody in the same basket as as Jews? Now everybody's doing it against Jews in the world, not only against like Israel, is Israelis. And Zionists and, and uh, but everybody against all the see his attacks like people are attacking him, like, like the kids and how do you put everybody in the same basket like like you asked me how do you put everybody in the same basket like like you yeah. know what I mean so we, we, we can never generalize okay, everyone so, so, we all agree. so, so what we are saying is look this is this is how we build up our common ground understanding before 200 years ago in Philistine did we see this kind of problems happening? Or did we see Muslims living with Jews and the Christians in Jerusalem itself in a way that is, in a way that is what? Mutually. No, no, I agree. In harmony. I, I agree with you. I'm not disagreeing so, with you. Yeah, so this happened. So we no, are you not personally. I'm not. Don't generalize. You personally. I'm talking about you yeah, personally. Yeah. So well, I'm, you well, ask me personal questions. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm so Rob, Rob, what we're saying is, we are not bringing no, a solution. No, uh, we, me, me. Fine. I am not putting forward a solution or a suggestion of a solution, which is totally radical. I am saying this solution existed at one point. And there wasn't a problem with this solution. Now, now. I'm talking about now. I, I, about I, I am, I am, no, no. I am Get bringing this point. for a reason. Okay. If how it was working then, people lived interacting with themselves. Muslims there, Christians there, Jewish people there. No problem. When did the problem happen and why happened? We really, we know why. Because when the Again, we, we. Let me just make it me, right? Not me. When I realize, I'm speaking to you. I'm not. When I realize, to Rob. When I realize, the power balance went from the Muslims to the Israelis. The problem started. When the power was at the hands of the Muslims, they ensured the security, the sanctity, the dignity, the value of life for everyone. That's how we know from history. Okay. That's how we know. This is how it worked. The moment the power shifted from the Muslims to the Israelis, to the Jewish people, no, that's where is, again, Israelis, Israelis. No, but see, you, no, you no, no, generalize. No. You said no, no, it. No. It's on camera, like you told no, me no, before. No, what I'm saying, it's on camera. No, no, what I say, Israelis. It's, it's a generalization, right? I'm no, not generalizing. No, again. Israelis. Are you happy? All right. When the power shifted, that's when we see all these problems happening. It's clearly an observation. Okay. So, if you want, after solutions, the ultimate solutions. The ultimate solutions is not two state, three state, and all the solutions. So what's the ultimate, ultimate solution? solution is how it was. So, if we can go back to. How it's supposed to be? And you personally, you personally. Me? Forget about we, everybody. Yeah, I, I sometimes speak me as oh, a we. I get it. I me get as it. a we. That's I what I'm it. saying. You it's, still, it's still me. You think it's possible? Yeah. So I'm hopeful. So you see hope like me? I'm hopeful. <laughs> I'm hopeful. Because this is where I think, I think, justice can be done. Justice. Ultimately, justice has to be implemented. No, no, I agree. Even I agree. if it goes against me and my wishes, I have to speak and be a witness, truthful. Truth and witness. I have to testify to the truth. That's in the Quran. The Quran tells us, be a firm witness, even if it's against you, against your relative, against your kith and, um, kith and kin. Even if it goes against your own self. Even against the non-Muslim. Our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, yeah, it's recorded in the Hadith literature. Even if Fatima, his daughter, radiallahu anha, if she were to steal, she should face the penalty, the punishment, which is cutting off their hands. She should not be spared. So the ideas of favoritism, nepotism, and all these ideas like, oh, I am the prince and I am the son of the king and so on. That happens in every Muslim country almost. There's no favoritism. No, no, they are not implementing Islam. No, I know, I get that. That's what I said. We are showing, yeah. That's what I'm saying. We are. We want our Muslims brothers and sisters to know if you're in these countries, 
what's happening is not correct. It's so not Islamic. Everywhere then. So what do, what do you again? You not we. What do you believe? What I am saying. Forget I, about Israel. Forget no, no, about the Middle East. Do you I, believe the I, whole world? I I am a Muslim. Well, I know, but so I'm about... trying to say what Islam is saying, rather than my my personal belief needs to be molded according to Islam. No, but the whole if world, I don't follow the, whole world, the no, but the whole world. The whole world will see justice if they follow Islam. So the whole world. Yeah. The whole so world. There should no. There should no be no freedom because, for anybody. Because when people come, look. If Islam is implemented globally, for example, globally, if it's uh, globally, 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 globally. non-Muslims who don't want to become Islam, they will have their rights, and their right will be protected. No one can put a finger on them because that's how severe their punishment will be. Two, violate the rights of a non-Muslim citizen. That's how it's always been. They are called protected citizens. So Islam ensures a system in which, so which, so which justice you, can be... Okay, so which Islam do you believe? But hold on, let me finish, let me finish. Not, not Sunni or Shia, I'm, I'm asking which Islam do you believe? The Islam Islam that, of well, the Quran. No, I, I get it. Islam of Prophet Muhammad Okay, fine. I get it. But yeah. Islam, Islam they follow now in, let's say, Dubai. Okay. It's easy or, to differentiate. Or, or in Saudi or in Qatar. It's easy to differentiate. No, of course it is. That's why I'm asking. Whichever versions being implemented if it goes against the Quran and the teaching of the Prophet Islam, that's not the version to follow you can okay, easily fine. see that so, so, so the book have, that's source. it yeah the source. So the source you don't it. follow the people you follow oh, the source. source that makes sense Pleasure right. speaking to you, Rob. Okay, you. we we hope to um, speak in to you again two weeks, in, in two weeks <laughs> and see yeah, where, yeah, where you are. You. you know, because one thing for sure, okay. if you ask sincerely for guidance, God will guide you, and you are a sincere person. Okay? Try, try. All the best. Thank you. Take care. <laughs>